So let's talk about one of the sneaky ways that keeps people sabotaging in their careers and their lives. And that is the belief that they think they should be able to fix it themselves. The other day I had a wonderful conversation with a woman and her husband. And he said, Denise, my wife is amazing. She's got it going on. She even has her PhD. Why shouldn't she be able to figure this out on her own? And I said, your wife is an expert in what she does. She could hand me her PhD outline and I still couldn't do it. She could give me all of her references and I still couldn't do it because that's her expertise. My expertise is bringing amazing women together who you would never know are feeling stuck and suffering, are feeling not enough. You'd never know it, but it's sabotaging their, their happiness, their personal lives and their success. So shift number five is not to try and fix this yourself. If you've been trying, then you know, it just makes you feel worse because you read all the books, you watch the YouTube videos and you're still stuck. So if it's time to end your suffering, then it's time to get someone who knows how to fix this and can bring together a community that can help you accelerate your development. So I'll put a link in the notes in case you want to talk to me about this. The bottom line is you don't need to suffer and you don't have to fix this yourself. That's not your superpower. You have other superpowers that you can be proud of and put all your energy into that. And let's fix this quickly because there's no need to suffer anymore.